Well, it's definitely the easiest plan that I have ever done, and that is always a benefit. Uh, this is about the 10th time I've read the Bible through in a year, and I'm just amazed that the Word of God is living and active. Bible reading has benefited me in showing me the things that I struggle with the most. I always come up with something more that I can work on in my own life. I love the Bible reading. I love how easier they made with the Bible already set up with the chapters and verses. I just loved being able to read it every day, just turn the pages and it's all there. I have been trying to read the Bible every morning, so reading the Bible first thing and spending that time with the Lord just really sets my mind and sets my day where it needs to be. Well, I don't think you can read the scriptures without growing. I feel like just reading has refreshed me. As a result of reading the Bible, I've grown um, in a lot of ways. Um, but one of the biggest ones is probably just realizing I always find encouragement in the Word. Um, things like my identity in Christ, who I am as a, as a person who, who shouldn't have any fear um, of things to come and should just rely on God for, for all the things that I need. I have grown so much in my faith, in my fellowship with Christ, in learning more and being reminded of the stories. It reminds us of the promises of God that has helped me uh, developing my faith and just going into a deeper relationship with Christ. So I don't know, every time you read the Bible, even these familiar stories, something new can minister to you wherever you are. God uses it to speak to you. If you are behind, uh, don't worry about it. Um, it's not something that you know defines you being behind in a, in a Bible reading plan, but it is really important when you start something to finish it. Um, and I would say if you've made that commitment that, um, that you need to get back to that original idea as to why you committed to it. Um, and, and then from there you can press back in and, and really just get what God wants you to get from it. I would say just starting is the biggest challenge and just take it one day at a time. Because um, God will, His Word, He will use whatever to minister to you no matter where you start reading. So just start is the biggest thing. There is a spiritual happening of I am a part of a body that is working toward a common goal. And that common goal is that we all come to know the Word and know not only the Word, the written Word in the Bible, but know Christ who is the living.